Hello friends. Do you know Arduino Uno has come out with a brand new version R4? There are two R4 variants available. I picked the fully loaded Uno R4 Wi-Fi variant today. Apart from many new features over Uno R3, I find the 12 by 8 LED matrix display built on the board as the most attractive feature added on this revision. You will find all the details about this new Uno board's features on our Uno webpage. In this video, I will show how quickly you could get started with your first animation on Uno R4 Wi-Fi board. The LED matrix has 96 red-colored LEDs arranged in eight rows, each row having 12 LEDs. Once you install Arduino Uno R4 board files, you will also have access to the example sketches for the same. I am going to open Play Animation Example Sketch from the LED Natrix menu, and I will modify it. The example sketch is not a complex one, isn't it? This is the beauty of Arduino. You can make use the library Arduino LED Matrix to get started very quickly. In the code, functions from the Arduino LED Matrix libraries are used. These functions are namely load sequence, begin and play. The data related to the LED bit patterns and the sequence is defined in the header file named animation.h. We need to just enter our data here to play the animation we want to display. Note that each sequence has 96 bits of data entered in hexadecimal format. Each pattern is entered in 3, 32 bit or 4 byte format. The last value could be modified to increase or decrease the delay for which one pattern is displayed. We could just make a quick tool in Excel to figure out our data. At the same time, we could just visualize how it would look on the LED matrix display. In this Excel tool, 12 columns and 8 rows are used. Each cell emulates the respective LED in the same position in the matrix. Between two adjacent rows, a blank row is kept as there are gaps between the LEDs. Similarly, an extra column is kept between two columns representing LEDs. Next, conditional formatting is used to highlight a cell if one is entered. This would simulate that an LED is turned on. If the cell has zero, it will not get the color. Yeah, I tried to animate a cat and entered once in the cells to get a pattern looking similar to a cat. Excel formulae are used to convert these bits into hexadecimal format broken into 332 bits or 4 byte data. Please take a closer look at what happens to the data in the table when I switch the value of a cell from 0 to 1 and vice versa. The hexadecimal value also changes. Once you make this tool, rest is opening your creativity endlessly the same tool can be copied in multiple worksheets to create the other patterns in the sequence here four different patterns are created to animate a cat walking after the led bit patterns are created for the animation sequence 96 bits representing each of the sequences are entered in the header file animation.h you could also rename this header file differently and at the same in the sketch.ino file allow me to update the header file with the data pattern for the animation sequence from the excel next i will compile and upload the sketch to the uno r4 wifi board and i will show you how the animation looks